It is fall here at Stage Right. It's fall everywhere, which means pumpkin spice lattes and leaves turning and Christmas decorations being out at Walmart. It also means that our homeschool program is about to start its semester. Twice a year, we uh, have our homeschool group come in and they get together for eight to 10 weeks and then create a production. Our homeschool program has become one of our most favorite things that we do here uh, because of the audience it serves and also because of the unique opportunity it gets uh, us to have with these kids. Um, if you don't know anything about homeschool students, this is a short primer for you. These are students that are being educated by their parents and by cyber schools and by other organizations outside of a normal brick and mortar school. The responsibilities that those parents take on and these kids is pretty tremendous uh, and they give them a chance to create their own education. Uh, that of course adheres to all the standards of Pennsylvania, but also gives them the unique ability to do things like, well, a program here at Stage Right, where they get to come here two hours a day, twice a week, and they get to explore the art that they love. So they get to sing with Cindy Baltzer, they get to dance with Renata Marino, and then they get to put together a show this year, Fiddler on the Roof, with all of us that they get to perform uh, in December uh, on a stage fully produced. It gives them a chance to take part in the education of theater, which is really a beautiful thing. Uh, as I said, this semester it's Fiddler on the Roof, and we picked that show when I put it out there, I didn't give a big long explanation when I put it out to our homeschool uh, uh, nation as to what they wanted to do. The reason I wanted to do it is because I think there's no better show that, that shows the unity of a community than Fiddler on the Roof. It's one of my most favorite shows of all time, uh, one that I've gotten to do a number of times, and I like it for that very reason. Every time I've done it, a community evolves within the rehearsal process. Uh, and that is so loving and so supportive and it really is a mirror to what I see with our homeschool families that, that take part in this. It really is a family event when the homeschoolers get together and, and Homeschool Nation comes to stage right uh, and there are moms helping with props and costumes and, and folks like well the guy behind the camera here Dr. Dennis Juris he's a homeschool parent doing these kinds of things and, and myriad other uh, things that service the, uh, the show that we're doing and, and the entire program so it really is this communal effort that I think is uh, tremendously beautiful and uh, you can still be a part of it if you'd like to uh, we've just started but it lasts like I said eight to ten weeks before we do a, a full performance of it and we'll have the details as the full performance probably written somewhere around here, uh, but you can still take part in it and join. And don't be hesitant, because that's one of the greatest things about Stage Right, period. Uh, but about the homeschool program, you're always welcomed with open arms. You're always asked to be a part of that community and take part in it, uh, uh, just like the folks uh, in, in the stories being told in Fiddler on the Roof. So our homeschool program this fall semester, fall and winter semester, is Fiddler on the Roof. It involves our preteens and our teens working together to create one show, probably multiple casts, because there's a dizzying amount of talent in this group, and we're very excited to get started with them. You should come join myself and Cindy Baltzer and the most talented woman in the world, Renata Marino, as we create our homeschool program this fall, Fiddler on the Roof. You will not want to miss it. Come to Stage Right and check this out.